Henry has permission to work remotely, and today Henry has decided to work from home in the morning. Hi Henry, I would like you to write a post for our internal blog. Please draft the first version this morning. Let's meet after lunch and go through it together. Find attached some guidelines on how to write blog posts. If you need any further advice, don't hesitate to ask me or your other colleagues for help. Good luck, Maria. I have never blogged before. How am I going to come up with a blog post? Then he remembers Maria's advice to keep an open mind when facing new challenges. What the heck? I can do it. Now, where do I start? Henry starts surfing the internet to get ideas and facts for the blog post. He finds great tips and immediately feels more confident. Henry organizes an online call to get input from his colleague. Henry has finally succeeded in gathering all the materials he needs for his blog post. He has also checked Maria's writing guidelines. Now he is a bit confused about how to continue, so he decides to ask his friend Sofia, who writes her own blog, for lunch to get her advice. Sofia's advice turns out to be really helpful. Henry heads to the office light-hearted. Now that Henry has a clear vision of the content of his blog post, he gets down to business. He works hard and gets a first draft done. Henry feels quite proud of himself. Henry meets with his supervisor Maria to review the post. Maria is very pleased to notice that Henry has followed her guidelines, but has still managed to bring his own fresh ideas. Henry publishes his post to the company's internal blog and immediately receives positive feedback. Whoa! Even though I decided to write my post a bit differently, they actually liked it, and it's encouraging to see that new ideas are welcomed and appreciated. In working life, you cannot avoid doing things you've never done before. Undertaking tasks that are new to you. Force you to be creative and think critically. Remember that all learning happens outside your comfort zone. Every time you accept a challenge, you learn something new, which you can leverage in your work life later on. The lessons learned won't always be positive ones, but learning the hard way is really important and unavoidable. So don't be afraid of mistakes. Taking ownership of your doings and accepting uncertainty are key attributes in an entrepreneurial mindset. Being entrepreneurial means that you have to be brave enough to take risks and learn from your own mistakes. It doesn't matter what you do; it's how you do it that counts.